Who all is glad to be out of the house and back on the street to have some fun? Amen. And no better excuse whatsoever than memory days. Mike, I see the first of our contingents headed this way. All right. Great. We're going to get, do our uh, national anthem here in a few minutes. Grayson Chamber of Commerce thanks the, all the city officials for putting this together. And, you know, we've been waiting and waiting for this to happen. And, of course, uh, COVID stepped in. But you know what? We... We beat code, we got around it, we do our own thing, we're going to do it this year, and we're so happy to be here this year, and so happy to see all of you out today. Ladies and gentlemen, coming down the street, we are soon to have the colors presented by the cadets and uh, JROTC at East Carter High School. I know you guys know this by heart, but when Old Glory comes before us and the colors are presented, if you have a hat on, gentlemen, that needs to come off. Ladies and gentlemen, you can salute by putting your hand over your heart if you've not been in the military. Our veterans in the group will probably salute. Ladies and gentlemen, that has been the colors as presented by the JROTC Color Guard. Before us now, old girl Lori has made it to the Veterans Park. It is my great honor to introduce to you singing our national anthem this afternoon, Miss Scarlett Williams, an eighth grader at East Carter Middle School, if you would please, the national anthem. Oh, say can you see that those are great members of the Boy Scouts of Carter County and we have troops 163, one troop 163 and also I'm reading patches 7163 and you guys are here with us today pulling hard. Tell us all about these great flag bearers today. This is uh, also got troop 168 here helping us too. It's a big flag, it's a big job, and it gives me goosebumps to see it. Thank you all for bringing it to the Veterans Park in Memory Days. Let's hear it for our flag bearers today. Big round of applause. I 
I am serious. That that big flag and the color guard in front of it and the national anthem, I seriously got some chills. I'm feeling the big, powerful, patriotic American self today. I hope everybody else is with me. I hope you are. And leading off the parade, some of those very important people without whom we could not sleep safely at night and feel good in our beds, and that is the great folks with the Grayson Police Department. They've also been hard at work today helping police and help block roads and help get us ready for memory days. Always, always working hard for us. We appreciate that so much. And right on their heels, Mike, who's that? We've got some elected officials. We've got Senator Robin Webb coming in. We do. And here, that's what our Grand Marshal, though, is uh, first up. We're watching, we're watching, and right here is... Give me that fist, uh, Mr. Sheriff. Oh, it is our Sheriff of Carter County. What's up, Jeff, May? Hello, Jill. How is everybody, guys? Everybody doing okay? Well, good. Good, good, good. Guys, and listen, uh, we've got to remember this day for the ones that have sacrificed their lives for us. You know, uh, you know I'm a veteran, and I, I, I salute every veteran out here. Never forget our, our law enforcement, our first responders out here to take care of business. So. Uh, you all have a great day and, and take care this weekend. We thank you, Sheriff, and all your fine deputies. So take good care. Everybody be safe. More Sheriff Department here, more Carter County. Deputies in tow. Well to see you. Good to see you. Here comes all those great folks. Mike, you said we got Grand Marshals rolling. Have we seen them yet? It's the K9. The K9 Department. K9 units here. Look coming here, Mr. Memory Days' unit, Bob Commissar. Bob Commissar is represented in the parade here at Bot Lane. Now, you presented a really special award to, to Bob the other night, didn't you, at opening ceremony? Yes, I did. Mr. Memory Days, Bob Commissar. He didn't want to ride today. It's in the rain. I mean, I don't blame him, but uh, I think it's going to be really fun. I still wanted to drive the car through the parade and let everybody know that he's Mr. Memory Days. He is, and that's why he's that important. When you run memory days for about 45 years, you get to send a proxy to the parade if you feel like it. Yes, yes you do. Here's our Grand Marshals rolling through. Yes, it is the family of Jim Phillips. Hey guys, there's Deanna and Cindy and all through all, and up front, the long-standing partner in crime, KJ, we recognize KJ from the radio station. Let's give it up for the Welcome Phillips family. Welcome the Grand Marshals. And, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, talk about longevity and coolness. It's the 50th memory days, yeah. but this lady <laughs> over here, she's been in business in this town for... 60. 60. 60 days, put your hands together 60 for days. the amazing Ruth 60 Hayes. years. <laughs> Woo, 60 days, because she's only 17, don't you? Oh, that's right. That's it, that's it. Lovely to see you, you Steve, right there. Everybody come by and buy something sparkly for Miss Haney at Haney's Jewelry. <laughs> oh my goodness, cool stuff coming here. Our Carter County Judge Executive. Let's give it up for Mike Malone, Carter County Judge Executive, and all of the great folks on board there. Throw in the goodies and woo, cool stuff. Right behind them is Brian Bays, Carter County Attorney. The Bays crew in the house. Hey, it's our county attorney. What's up, Brian? How's, how's day going? 
good. It's a little cold, but it's good. That's all right. You'll work up sweat for it's over with. Don't you hurt. More walkers and contingent with Brian Bates, County Attorney. And this memory days, Libby Davis. Lord Honey Children, who's in the back of that truck? Jason Smith, ladies and gentlemen. TV hey. celebrity chef. Jason, thank you for being with us. Let's talk for a minute. How much fun have you had? Lord, honey, if I've had any more fun, they'd probably put me in the jail because we're having so much fun. Listen, from all the glitter and all the people and the candy, listen, it's been the best Memorial Day yet, honey. I'm telling you what, if you ain't found something to enjoy right now, then you're in the wrong spot because we got everything you'd ever want, honey, children. I can tell you that. Y'all have a great memory day. I love you and all. Everybody's my family right here. Love y'all so, so much. Have a great one. Got another buddy rolling into town here. Looking good, looking good. It's the Steve Walnut family on board. Steve, how much fun are you having today? Uh, it's just wonderful, Jill. Uh, happy Memorial Day, everybody. And uh, go to the cemetery. That's right. It's a day for memory and memory making. Here comes Leslie Kaiser, our PVA here in Carter County. Leslie's on the gazebo side of things. Hey, Les, got a Memorial Day message for the folks. Thank you to all our veterans and our first responders. Of course, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Leslie Kaiser Rosenberry, our PVA. Miss Memory Days, runner-up, Kara Spillman and People's Choice Award winner. Look at this big, beautiful black truck. Where is that pretty pageant gal? Oh, she's cruising in the back back here. Yes, she is. That's the way. Congratulations. And the first of our amazing men in the fences that make good things happen for the crippled children. The Shrine, El Hassa, the temple in Ashland, Kentucky. And here comes the potentates riding in. We would not be Merry Days without you guys today. Sir, you have a Memory Days message for our fans. We want to thank everybody for being here. And remember our military, remember our all of our fallen. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the potentate. And right with him, the gentleman of the divine. Thank you fellas for being with us as always. My favorite, the Oriental fan! Now, of course, all of these amazing units from El Hassa Shrine will travel all over the state of Kentucky through the summer months. They'll be everywhere. They'll be spreading the message of the great community involvement and philanthropic efforts of the Shrine and of all of the various temples and the lodges that, that work with the Shrine. And they'll be making amazing things happen for kids in need. Pure country! I love those red colors, and Jeeps are my favorites. Pure country, automotive with us here. Great friend to the city, great friend to memory days, and all things good happening in the community. Come see them if you need something sharp to drive. Here comes the All-Stars from Cosmic. All-Stars cheer and tumbling in Oliveville, Kentucky. And the owner and the super coach involved, my friend from high school, Amy, what's up? Memory Days is about old oh, friends. So, so tell us what's happening in Austin McCall. Well, this year we have a lot of things to offer. We have all-star cheer. We have volleyball that we've just added. Soccer, basketball, and hip-hop dance. And you can have a birthday party at the Cosmic Center. Give it up for the cuties and the talented athletes at the Cosmic Center. Hey, Mike, 
I'm feeling under the sea. Do you uh, see these bubbles? Tiny bubbles. Tiny bubbles. <laughs> and on board, we have Little Miss Memory Days, runner-up and photogenic, Caitlin Navarre. Sophia Villasenor. Sophia Villasenor. Oh, and there's the trophies to prove it. Look at these special, gorgeous people on board. How about that? Look, it's a tiny, tiny person on top of a big, big truck. Look, wave in there. Bristol jo Gordon, Kobe Jordan. We miss Memory Days runner up. What's up, Bristol? She cute. Wave at the gazebo. <laughs> Another fabulous pageant person rolling this way. Miss Grayson, 2020. Alyssa Williams on board here. Here are our friends from Tres Hermanos Nunez. And we can always count on two things for sure with the folks from Tres Hermanos. Style, great food, and today they had a third. Awesome, cool t-shirts for the crowd. Absolutely. Those are great. And on board here, look waving to the crowd is Miss Grayson's outstanding team, Jasmine Webb. Jasmine, wave at that gazebo over there. Put your hands together for our very own outstanding team, Jasmine Webb. Okay, this is the coolest thing I've seen today. I think I need one of those. And you're writing in honor of the folks who haven't come home. Is that right? Yes, to remember our prisoners of war when we remember all who served. That's awesome. Thanks for being with us today. We got an award winner. Yes, we do. What is the award we have won? People with the list. Overall best commercial. Come get this. It's Dixie Dixie Lanes. Is this you? Is this you? Oh, you got to tell us about it. Well, we had a, had, had a hard time fighting with the rain, but uh, we was lucky enough that Chris and Brooke McFarland let us use their uh, garage, so we was able to get in there for a little bit and stay out of the rain and get it going. It looks awesome. Here's our first award-winning float of the day. Dixie Lanes and ZZ's Bar and Grill. Oh, look at this. Another precious beauty queen on board. Look toward the gazebo. Tiny Kinsley, Miss Memory Days. Joe Jackson, Tiny Miss Memory Days, and Miss Photogenic. And oh my goodness, we are talking total photogenic, and she's got a bunch of candy handlers on board. Give it up, everybody. Give this sweetheart a wave. Welcome to Memory Days, kiddo. And look on board here. I think that's a big giant eagle, am I right? That's a big eagle out there. That is a serious big eagle, the, the symbol of our country, the bald eagle. And this is the great folks with NECO. Yes. Who are always out there making sure that every kid that needs a mom and dad finds one. We're about fostering and making forever families for these kids in need. If you would like to become a foster parent, the folks at NECO can help you get that done. So... Put that in your phone right now, that phone number, foster parents needed, they build families. The great folks from NECO, out today in the Memory Days Parade. And up on board, Team Miss Memory Days is riding through. Jaden Williams. Got another big, beautiful float coming through. These are our friends at Center Stage Studio. You want to talk?
talk talent, you want to talk precious people in tutus and tap shoes and tumblers, they are right here. The good crew from Center Stage. Let's hear it for them. And another trophy going here, Jill. Another trophy? What trophy's going here? Shelly. Best overall non-commercial. Goes to East Carter Volleyball. District Champions. This is awesome. Let's roll the truck on through. And then we'll stop the kids right in front of the gazebo. You need to hang on to this. Some more gold to go with those championship hardware. There you go. Next up, we have our folks from the American Legion. And you guys will remember that even though we're celebrating really hard out here today, Memorial Day is about remembering those who served in the armed forces and gave the ultimate sacrifice on the battlefield for our nation. So we appreciate the poppies and the motto, lest we forget. Let's all just make our minds up right now to never forget. And remember, the freedom is not free. Sons of the American Legion Post 342, Willard, Kentucky. Thank you for bringing this message home to us today and every day. Mike, is it just me or are these beauty queens multiplied? Oh, they are. <laughs> they and look are. at this one. She's Little so Miss cute. Memory Days is here. Little Miss Memory Days. Emery Fitzpatrick. Emery Divine Fitzpatrick. Right. And you are absolutely She's divine, divine, young lady. Definitely. Yes, she is. Let's give it up for Miss Emery! I've been his wife a long time. Yes. Danny had to have a moment. <laughs> All the cool stuff that's going on in your shop. What, are you, what can you tell us about? Oh my goodness, we do massages, Reiki, herbalism, spray tans, counseling, anything you can think of to help yourself, we got it. And you don't, if you're right here with us, you don't have to walk far because you're located right over there. Hey Ladies, Jill, they got a trophy. They're getting a trophy. Yay, Shelly is, this is hardware. Best hardware. Our best, best, best theme commercial. Now we got some cool young people coming here. Here comes the group from Rancor, and if you've ever seen them working those blades, working those sabers, they know how to get it done. They want to invite you to join them at 6 p.m. on Sundays at the Grayson Art Gallery. So just bring that rapier, bring that blade, bring that sword. Bring that dagger, come on down, and be your best self from whatever time, planet, or legend that you want to do it. Isn't that the coolest thing? So may the force be with them. I'm telling you. Yes. These guys are so good with these blades, they get you coming and going. They'll do this some that sneaky out the back stuff. A blade comes from nowhere. Come through here is Pathways and their brand new recovery vehicle. Look at this sharp thing right here. This is awesome. This is the coolest, and we are so grateful at Memory Days for Pathways coming on board as our corporate sponsor this year. Yes. Pathways to Go. Pathways to Go is their mobile behavioral unit that travels to remote and other designated locations in the 10 county catchment area that they provide services for. 
anyone who's struggling with behavioral health through traditional means but doesn't have the transportation to get to any of the clinics, guess what? They can access this through the Pathways to Go. Secure private space with the same mental health counseling services, substance use treatment services, and educational materials provided that you would normally find in a brick and mortar facility can be brought to you. This is like care to go. Very care special people here, very, very, very special people. They are proud to partner with health care providers, health departments, and other organizations representing underserved populations to bring in-person mental health and addiction services to you. A very, very cool addition to the basket of treatments and behavioral health needs and providers here in Carter County. So thank you to Pathway. Look, coming here, who's ready to go to the lake? Anybody go to the lake yet? Who's been fishing? Who's had a boat on the water? If you haven't yet, you need to, and I see McLean. And they have a trophy. Our friends at the Corps of Engineers are another award winner. Best overall, non-commercial division. Check it out. Roll that on through so we can get the beautiful Corps of Engineers castle up here on screen. And they want to remind you to practice all the good best boating safety. And look what I've got for you guys. Absolutely turn around and wave at the gazebo. Check it out. We've got Bobber the water dog on board. Bobber says always wear your life jacket. When you're around the lake, they want you to play and have all kinds of fun, but they want you to do it safely. Put your hands together from our friends with the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers. You're building a hot rod, aren't you? You're building a hot rod, you're just not going to tell me. Check it out, Memory Days is about that. Who out there ever cruised in something this cool? This one's coming on, it's got the thrush mufflers and all the good stuff. On board, we have Little Miss, second runner-up, Hadley Grace for Mini Miss Memory Days, and also Arletta Jean, Mini Miss Memory Days, first runner-up. Oh my goodness, they've got the sashes, and they're looking good today. Aren't they precious? You guys wave over at the guys at the gazebo. Here's our friends from Ch Carter Child Care and Early Learning Center. Oh, Early Learning Center on board. Absolutely. So there's the number to call if you want to send some kids their way. And these are the smiling faces that will take good care of them. Put your hands together for Carter Child Care and Early Learning Center. Thank you for being part of Memory Day. Just opened up a new uh, facility over the West End as well. We have Polly Yates Photography and 346 Woodworks. Oh my goodness, 346 Woodworks and Polly Yates Photography making things beautiful and making good pictures of all the beautiful things so we can keep up with it. Helping us celebrate memory days today. And I'm liking those shirts. Check out those shirts, Mike. Wonder where they got those. Uh huh. Uh huh. Seen a few of those before. The official commemorative 50th Memory Days t shirts being represented. They're totally represented. They got on the 50th anniversary shirts. Oh my goodness, there's a beautiful, tiny young lady in red up on top of this big, big, big truck. Miss Hallie Jo Wade, many Miss Memory Days. Put your hands together for Hadley, Joe Wade. Look at that. She's a beauty. Now I need one of these right here. Look at this. From 
Work and Drum Records here in Grayson, Kentucky. Check this out. This is Cruising in Style. Cruising in Style. And I hear Taps is playing. Taps is playing. It's about our veterans. And I just want everyone to know this week your Grayson Rotary Club handed over a check to Honor Flight Kentucky for $2,000. $250 to put four veterans on a plane so they can go see their memorials. Give it up. Oh, that's awesome. The Vindicator takes the main stage at 5 p.m. Bring your flags. We'll bring the rock and roll to you again. And there you go. How about that? That's the awesome part about small town living. Groups helping groups to make good things happen. Right here on board. Small Miss Memory Days over in the side by you guys, it looks like. Sitting there all sparkly and waving. Miss Addison Radcliffe. Oh, no, you want to talk about some extra special people and some awesome services. The great folks at Northeast Head Start who are all about making sure that our little babies get started off right to be able to hit school hard when the time is there. Isn't that correct? Now you guys have a lot of different places all around the county, so tell us about a couple. Um, we serve Carter County, Lawrence, Greenup, in Elliott County. We are currently taking students, um, so please stop by at your nearest center and we'll get that application started. Um, if you have any questions, you can call us at Central Office um, at 606-286-4443. Oh, you're so welcome, and thank you all for everything you do. It truly is a head start. It makes sure everybody hits that first grade, second grade, right where they need to be. So put your hands together for a super service, and we, and we want to make sure you know all about it. I also, I also want to point out we got our pass. And then present and future are on our bus. Oh, look at here. So we got some of the... That's too awesome. Memory Days connections all the way. Wait to see you guys. Thanks for being part of Memory Days. Put your hands together for the past, the present, and the future. Northeast Head Start. Oh, my gosh. When you want to talk about fun folks and good community partners... Yes, absolutely. Right here. Right here, give it up for the good folks down at Dionysus Beverage and Sales. They are doing tastings. They're putting cool stuff out on social media. Anything awesome happening at the store today? It's memory day, so I know there is. We're there. <laughs> Yay, Dionysus! This looks like a whole bunch of East Carter kids to me. This is the senior class 2021. Give it up for the East Carter Raiders. <laughs> yes. Well done, guys. Congratulations on making it through a deeply weird school year. <laughs> We're, we're ready to be normal! Congratulations, guys! Take on the world! Get it done! Ah. Oh, you're with the... Oh, well, you better go have to run to keep up with this bunch of seniors. You ready? All right. Here's the tiny Mr. Memory Days, Cade Hewlett. Oh my goodness, we got our first handsome gentleman. Check him out here in his red, white, and blue. Oh, I'm seeing a fella who would much rather be driving the truck than riding in the truck. That's what I'm seeing. And a heartbreaker waiting to happen. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for tiny Mr. Memory Days, Cade Hewlett. Big cool truck on board. Who's coming up, Mike? <laughs> Tiny Mr. Memory Days here. First runner up. Nicholas Huesca. First runner up. Tiny Mr. Memory Days. Look at that. He's got the ball cap representing. Totally cool. Tiny Mr. Second runner up. 
Fisker. 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 And rolling along here, man, we've got all the gentlemen in a row. Tiny Mr. Most Photogenic, Fisher Blevins. Fisher has got the curls to die for. I am close Lord. enough to see. Fisher, wave at the guys over there under the gazebo. Hey, look at me. I'm jealous of that hair. Of course, I'm jealous of anybody's hair. But I know this crew. Put your hands together for Fisher Blevins. Tiny Mr. Most Photogenic. Here's Miss Brinley Felty. Brinley Felty is we Miss Memory Days, and she's all oh she got a, she's bundled up. She knows it's not a a 2,000 degree in the shade day for Memory Days, and she's looking way too cute. Put your hands together for we Miss Memory Days. Look coming here, our friends with homespun sisters and all the blues. We got to brag on them, Mike. Not only yes. do they do cool stuff in the parade and in the community, but they've been selling shirts for us. They have. They're awesome chamber members. Yes. They work hard at everything, and they're giving out popsicles because they're just that cool. <laughs> Here's the baby Miss Memory Days, Ivy Grace Cox. Ivy, wave at the guys of the gazebo. A Christ-centered recovery program for hurts, habits, and hang-ups. Meeting Tuesdays at 6.30. It is Celebrate Recovery. Outstanding, a new, wonderful place for people to put their food under themselves and turn their lives around. Can you tell us more about it? Can... Well, it is, it's a 12-step recovery program for anybody that has a hurt, habit, or hang-up, um, which is all of us if we all look at our lives. So we believe that everybody could benefit from it, and we also have a youth program and a children's program, so there's something there for everybody, and we have free food starting at 545, so you really can't go wrong. It sounds like if you need a little bit of help, this is the place to start. Celebrate recovery. And look here, coming down the street, is the ice cream truck. I'm, I'm out of here. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. It's the monkey bars from our friends at Snowy. And I have it on good authority that if you find them after the parade, you can probably score a treat for free. Oh, I heard, right. that. I heard that. One of our local churches, one of our local churches is sponsoring that. First Baptist. First, First Baptist. Baptist. First Baptist is going to see to it that you get a cool treat after the parade. Catch the monkey bars. Thanks, guys. Happy Memorial Day. And here's our mini Miss Photogenic, Willow Mays. Willow is a little bit snoozy. I can see inside and I can tell you she is the most photogenic. She's adorable. She's got strawberry blonde hair, so I'm already predestined to like her a little bit. And she's a doll baby. Put your hands together for Willow Mays, mini Miss Photogenic. Oh, here's a new float for us. Yeah, here's Wildcat Roofing. This is a great, look at this truck. They, they done you guys have got it decorated up good. And as many storms as we've had around here lately, you guys probably got plenty to do in the neighborhood. You do. Go to gals for roofing. Wildcat Roofing. Now this one right here has got, a, he, uh, he is just zen about it all. He's like, parade, I'm there. I'm good. This is precious. Way to go, Wildcat Roofing. Glad to have you with us today. Look, it's our buddies at Rent to Own. Oh, thank you so much. And they get I, the future so bright. The future so bright, I got to have shade. Thank you. Oh, 
Rev that puppy up. Oh my goodness. Now I remember when you were building on this. It is complete and it is cool. We're completely ready to go now. You are. Now tell me how many people you fed last night. I heard you ran out of food. We ran out probably seven. There were several hundred people. I'm not sure on the number, but it was quite a bit. Outstanding. If you guys can't see it, this is part of the Grayson Volunteer Fire Department's K-1. Kids 1, the fire truck, and look at them little firefighters in training here. Check them out. Hey Mike, it's about to be all of the great men and women who volunteer to keep us safe yes. when the flames are approaching. Very hard workers. Got you out of rescue number two. Welcome Rescue One! Of course all the great folks at the Grayson Volunteer Fire Department fed the whole community last night. Fed them barbecue, fed them chicken, fed them fried fish. And they did such a good job of it and had so many sides that most of Grayson was waddling around by 6.30 last night. We overindulged and it was wonderful. But you know, every dollar that you donate to the fire departments comes back in training and equipment and keeping the lights on in the firehouses, you won't find a better use for your money as a donation than in a fireman's bucket at a bucket brigade or a dinner at a firehouse. We got some junior firefighters in engine number seven. Look at there. We do. Juniors are on board. And here comes tanker number one. I like all these fire trucks, but tanker number one's got kind of a retro, lean, mean hood and things up here. I think I, I like, it may be my favorite. I can remember when the big super tower and ladder trucks first arrived on the scene here in Grayson. It was a 1986 kill. Was it 1986? 1986. Tower number one so represented today. We want to thank everybody for coming out for this 50th anniversary. The rain held off for the parade. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, give it up for our fabulous firefighters. Here comes Braun, Volunteer Fire Department. Rescue, Rescue 431. You want to talk about a little firehouse that's got a lot going on? It's this bunch right here out at Braun. If they're not raising money, they're working on a good cause, or they're building on the firehouse, or they're taking care of people. We need volunteers. And the best way is show up at the firehouse and say, I'm here to help. That's correct. You'll tell them how and get them lined up, won't you? All right, Ron Fire Department is looking for volunteers. Looking for volunteers. Rescue Seven from Webville Fire and Rescue. Yay, Webville! Our buddy's just barely across the line, and we all work well together, don't we, sister? Well, all you all got going, you're always doing good stuff up there. Always trying, always trying. And we appreciate you so much, and I know those families you see with those with those jackets on, they appreciate you too. Put your hands together for our friends from Wetville! Engine number 714. I want one of these so bad. But you know, 
they got to go out in the woods and help the folks on occasion that have found themselves lost, and they got the equipment to do it with. Way to go, guys. Thanks for being with us. Put your hands together for the Olive of Hell Fire Department. The pride of the west side, engine number one from Olive Hill. Looks like the last load to me. Look running along here, all cool and waving. Got those pageant waves down, don't you folks?